on this episode of The Haunted Side. Something's walking towards us right now. Did you hear that? Yes. Stacy, we're gonna come read you a story if that's okay. I'm going to read the book while you're in sensory deprivation. I like that idea. Stacy, are you moving? Oh, that was a like a little girl sounding voice. Make sure to give the video a like, and if you're new here, subscribe to the channel. What was that? It was out there, dude. Yeah. I thought you like ran into something. No. I went to adjust my mic and like something happened. Closer, too close to be outside noise. Yeah. Yeah, there's nobody out there. sounding running that we keep hearing. Here's the OR, or the emergency room. Yeah. Which is a super small emergency room. We're talking one patient at a time only. But I guess like out here, I mean... It's weird that there's like no door left. Just a gate. Where the people who needed help the most would come through. Yeah. Is that like... Is that like a fence or something that's like grown now? Let me see. Yeah. It's a fence that's like falling over. Yeah. I just... Blocked this part of the... Place off. We go walk down towards the cathedral. Yeah. Is it? Is it simple? That's what she said.
so quiet. <laughs> During our first walkthrough, it was so loud. Yeah. And now it is so quiet. Cool. It's just. Is that you? I stepped on it. Oh, oh, it's like a. Now it's just so eerily quiet. Alright, here's the chapel. It's like candles and candlesticks in there. It looked like a hand, <laughs> but it's, uh, it's like antlers. Okay. All right. I don't know. I just got like a. I hit with like a wave of something. That ball is moving to you. Oh, shit. That chair's right in front of me. Can't see a damn thing. <laughs> Sorry. <sighs> That's absolutely scared the hell out of me. You think it was the ball? I don't know. Should we go look before we go in there? Yeah. Stacy, did you move that ball? I think it's still in the same spot. Off to the side. Yeah, it's just right there. Yeah, it doesn't look like it moved. Stacy, would you move that, please? I rolled it to you. Yeah, it's still in the same spot. All right. Oh, my ears started ringing. Chapel? Yeah. We are being very quiet. <laughs> it, you know, it's, it's funny like, that you mentioned that. I was about to say that. Like, yes. normally we'd be like, how many spirits are in here? Can you, you know, can you talk to us? Yeah, we've, we've like me and you have just not been talking. Because I feel like the quietness of this place has kind of infected us. That's it. Uh, just... Super, just into listening, and it's a very I feel like something is with us. I don't know what it is, but I, f I do not feel like we're in here alone. I want. Oh my! It's at my feet, dude. It's right behind me. Four. Four. Right there. What is that? Candle. It will not just focus. It's a me. candle. What? I do not feel like we're in here alone. I want to. Oh my. Where the hell did it come from? I have no idea. Oh, what was Whoa. That? That was... Dude. Oh. It like. It sounded like it just. Like hit right behind me. Oh yeah. Who did that? Did you hear running? No. But where did it go? There's nothing here that that would have that. The altar is the only place I've seen a candle. Oh, I thought this was like a little thing for, you know, like a sconch, but it's not. No. Well, I kicked it here. It's glass. I'm just shocked it didn't shatter. Yeah, how did that not break? And 
why am I touching it? I don't know. <laughs> why didn't I pick it up? Were you wanting to put this on the altar? Dude. Yeah, look. Is it the same it's kind? the same kind. Exactly the same kind. Jeez. There's a power box on the wall in the hallway. Oh, I saw it. Do you want to go? Fiona. Fiona? Fiona. T H E O N I A. Sister Fiona had an office here. Is she still here? Sister Fiona? Dr. Noarski? TJ, Stacy, where are you right now? It's getting very, very cold on my left side. All yeah, right. Feel this right here. Yeah. <laughs> it's cold right just right here in general. Yeah. <laughs> it's cold right just right here in general. In a place that wasn't cold before. And, I mean it hasn't been that long since we came through here. No, and is this this doesn't even go outside, does it? I think it does, but it's it's like locked up, locked up. Oh, oh, jeez! <laughs> scared the hell out of me. me. decide to regroup and then head upstairs. All right guys, so we're gonna head up to the second floor um, where the library is. Uh, there's a book that supposedly Dr. Nowarski gave Stacy. Uh, and if you read that book, she's, it's supposed to help her uh, come out, help her communicate. Um, so we'll read the book and then Jason immediately goes, and I got a better idea. <laughs> I'm going to read the book while you're in sensory deprivation. I like that idea. I think something like that. I think something like that. It sounded like uh, like something jumped on the floor above us. No. No, that was that was like directly over there. Did you like that idea? You want us to go read the story? Do it. Stacy? We're gonna come read you a story if that's okay.
this room, right? Yeah, it's over here. The pokey little. The pokey little. What was that? I have no idea. The Where do you want to sit right here? I think that would be a good idea. Yeah. I don't know if I wanna. No, it feels pretty solid. Did that camera turn off? It did. Stacy, if you have anything to uh, let it tell us, you can do so. Patrick's going to read you a story. And I'm listening for you. Stacy. Oh. All right, Stacy. Oh. Something made a crazy loud noise down the hallway just now. Are you serious? Oh, that was creepy. Okay, Stacy, if you can hear me, we're going to read you this story. We heard that this is your favorite story. So five little puppies dug a hole under the fence and went for a walk in the wide, wide world. Through the meadow they went, down the road, over the bridge, across the green grass, and up the hill, one right after another. the hallway again. <laughs> that was a step right there. And when they got to the top of the hill, whoa. When they got to the top of the hill, they counted themselves one, two, three, four. One little pumpy wasn't there. Now where in the world is that pokey little puppy, they wondered. For certainly he wasn't on top of the hill. Stacy, do you want me to keep going? But when they looked down at the grassy place near the bottom of the hill, there he was, running round and around with his nose on the ground. 
What is he doing? The four little puppies asked. One another. The page just moved. It's moving. The four little puppies asked. One another. The page just moved. It's moving. So did we capture Stacy trying to turn the page? Or is this simply just an old book? Let me know what you think in the comments. The four little puppies asked. One another. The page just moved. It's moving. Stacy, are you moving? Oh, that was a a little girl sounding voice. What the hell was that? Uh, Stacy, are you moving? Oh, that was a, like a little girl sounding voice. What the hell was that? Uh, were you like, Moving in the chair. That. Dude. Somebody. Did you hear that? Uh, somebody walked up to you. I heard them come down the hallway, come in here. They walked up. Something made a loud ass noise over there. And then. I got like three pages in, dude. What the hell is that? I don't know. But we haven't heard that at all since we've been in here. Good Lord. I was not feeling good. In oh, that. dude. I dude. thought it was you moving around in the chair. And then I realized... No. No, couldn't be. Dude, there is nothing coming through the spirit box. And so it's just this white noise and I just started listening to it and I started thinking about where we were and the building. And I just started just like going with it and just like exploring the building with my mind. Oh my God. And then I heard that gigantic bang right next to me. Dude, I felt it. Dude, it was loud. Like it was like something went like this. <laughs> <laughs> you want to try, try that one more time? It, it was right here, dude. Like, oh yeah, right here. It sounded like one of these books, like, got thrown or dropped or something. I don't know. It was loud. I mean, I don't notice anything different than when I was here earlier. But it was so loud. I don't know. That was very creepy. Was there, obviously besides that, was there anything else going on out here? Oh, dude, yeah. There was noises down the hallway. Right as soon as you started, there was a noise. It sounded like somebody was coming down the hallway. And then I legit heard whatever that sound was. It was on the floor here. And I heard it come in. And I was like, are you serious? There's literally something walked in behind him right here. And then... Bam! Loud noise over here. Oh man. <laughs> that freaked me out. I think I still have the spare box on. It's tough to Let's set this down for a second. Sensory deprivation stuff set up. Or on set up. Are we upstairs? <laughs> yeah. I I like I'm so discombobulated right now. I don't know if I'm upstairs or downstairs. Like I was 
I was literally just like zoned. Wa- I was wandering around the building in my mind because I'm like, let's just think about where I am and just kind of try and feel the energy of this location. And so now I'm just, I don't know where I got ripped out of that in my head was. Jesus. That was weird. Bathroom. Anybody in here? I heard hello. From in there? I couldn't tell. Hello. Where are you right now? Is that you, Sister Thelona? Which is odd because we haven't come across a kitchen. Is it a kitchen? I don't know. Mm, there's no one for like a grill or anything. Yeah, maybe like a pantry. And this is like a big light right there. Do you want? Ooh. Is that you? I think I, I think so. Yeah, I think I hit the house. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for that. Okay. Stop. Ooh. Huh. Did you hear that? No. I heard that. That's where we're going to. The basement. Oh no. I don't, I don't think I agree with the basement. There it is, guys. <laughs> Did you hear that? What was that? I don't know. It was like. Did you hear that? What was that? I don't know. It was like... I always feel so stupid trying to recreate the sounds that we hear. That's okay. Because they're so unusual. Yeah. That's okay because I... I get laughed at all of them. (laughs) More than anybody. Oh, man. I just got... Shh! Listen. Can you do that again? Dude, twice I heard 
little girl sounding voice go Were we being too loud coming down here? Yeah. Where, where are we going? Back to the cage? Uh, yeah, I guess. <laughs> I guess. Anywhere down here is <laughs> creeping me out. Honestly. Why is there like four million bottles in here? I don't know. This is the party room. It's just that way. Over here is like a big storage room area. And then that if we go that way that's more towards the front of the building. Ah uh, yeah that's right. Yeah that's good to say. Yeah. I think out of this entire location the basement was the most unexpected. Yeah, we did you hear that? No. You did not hear that? No, what was it? It was like a big sound up ahead. No. The base, anyway, the basement is the most unexpected feature of this place. Oh, yeah. Because I was not expecting basically a, an entire another section oh, of the yeah. hospital. Yeah. Look at this wall, guys. This is how <laughs> run down this place is. The wall is bowed so badly. for because I'm pretty sure it's not a drunk tank what was that I heard like a scream yeah I heard it off to my right who's down here with us Why is there a big I wonder if this is the What was that? 